Welcome to the Morning Offering with Father Kirby, your daily call to prayer. Pray with us every day right here on the podcast and in your inbox. Learn more at morningoffering.com. Greetings, friends. Welcome to the Morning Offering with Father Kirby. Today is Wednesday, April 3rd, and today I'd like to talk about the momentum of evil. But first, let's pray together. In the name of the Father, of the Son, of the Holy Spirit, amen. O oh, Jesus, through the Immaculate Heart of Mary, I offer you my prayers, works, joys, and sufferings of this day for all the intentions of your Sacred Heart and union with the Holy Sacrifice of the Mass throughout the world for the salvation of souls, the reparation of sins, the reunion of all Christians, and in particular for the intentions of the Holy Father this month. Amen. In the name of the Father, of the Son, of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Well, friends, we know that through holy baptism and the workings of grace, we are called as the children of God to move glory unto glory. There's this momentum hardwired in our souls. So we, we, we are on the way. We, we are called to be moving somewhere. Well, the tragic part is when we're not cooperating with grace and we start engaging in sin and vice, well, there's a counter movement for evil. That same drive that we have when we're cooperating with grace to draw closer to God, when that's inverse, whew, and this is terrible, when that's inverse, we have the same drive to do evil and to rebel against God. That same push, that same momentum, that same energy, that's all just inverse. It goes counter to the reason why we received it. So we have this drive in order to every day go glory into glory. But when we say no to God's grace and we're rejecting God and we start engaging in sin and willful sin and habitual sin, then we have this same momentum, but towards evil. This is why we can see people who do small things and then suddenly they start doing greater things and then they start getting cruel and they start getting malicious. And it's like, how'd this happen? Or we can look at human history and we can look and say, how do we have death camps and killing fields? And how, how did this happen? How can human beings do this? Well, because we have a capacity for evil. It's the same capacity and it's a capacity that was given to us in order to draw closer to God. But when we pervert and distort what God has given to us, that drive, that push, it can become a momentum for evil. So we have to be very careful. In our lives, if we find that we've overstepped something in the moral life, if we are engaging in sin or realizing that sin is becoming more habitual, or we're finding that we are regressing into darker and darker sins, repent, repent. Get to confession. Guard that. Bring yourself back. Because that momentum that's in, your, in our souls, it will either be for glory or it will be for evil. And we were made for glory. So I encourage you, pursue glory. Allow your life to be marked by glory unto glory and not by a momentum of evil. And those are our thoughts for today, dear friends. I want to thank you for joining me. I encourage you, keep fighting a good fight. And remember, you can receive daily spiritual encouragement sent right to your inbox when you subscribe to The Morning Offering at morningoffering.com. God bless you. Thanks for listening today. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. The Morning Offering with Father Kirby is a production of Good Catholic, the media division of The Catholic Company. For more faith-filled podcasts and videos, visit goodcatholic.com.